Yo, what's up everyone? Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make this easy and clean transition and using your music videos and even just your videos in general. It's really simple to make and it makes your videos a lot better. So once you load up After Effects, you want to have your three clips ready and you want to split it like where you want the transition to happen. As you see, we have clip one and clip two here. And now what you want to do is you want to rotor brush the uh, subject in the second clip. So basically click on the rotor brush tool and then double click on your layer and just start rotor brushing your subject and if you make a mistake like this in your rotor brush hold alt and then as you see here you can just easily fix the mistakes when you're rotor brushing make sure to start in the first frame and then once you rotor brush your first frame just slowly go frame by frame and make sure that there's no mistakes and if there is just hold O and you can easily fix it once you've finished rotating brushing your clip and when you get to the last frame click the freeze and basically what that does is it just freezes your rotor brush so you can't make any accidental changes and stuff like that basically just locks it in and once that's done you can now click back on your selection tool and then close this layer and as you see our subject is now rotor brushed and to make it look a lot better on the edges uh, go to feather and just put that up and then use shift edge now when you have your rotor brush layer what you guys want to do is duplicate it by doing control D and then highlight the bottom clip and delete the rotor brush so then basically at the top as you see we have the subject and then the bottom we have the background so to make this transition work what you want to do is highlight both of these layers and then go around 3-4 frames back or just depending on how fast you want the transition to happen and now what you want to do is you want to go to the end of the first clip here and just drag the background layer so it ends there so basically what we have here is the subject comes in and then the background comes in later when the clip like actually ends now to do the effect you want to go on the subject layer and use the effect called tint which is completely free comes with after effects and where it says matte black 2 you want to click on the, the black square and you want to put it to white and that basically just turns it into white and now what you want to do is you want to press amount to tin which is basically set at 100 and then you want to go to where it ends which is where the background layer comes in and just drag that to zero so as you see the transition is basically done but if you want to make it a lot better and a lot smoother use one of my presets in my beat shape pack and I'm going to show you how to use it. So what you want to do is you want to make an adjustment layer and drag any one of my presets. So as you see I just added one of my presets on the adjustment layer and it makes the transition so much smoother with the beat shake. And if you want to cop the pack it's in the description so on sale right now use code yeet for 10% off. Anyways I hope you enjoyed this video and make sure to leave a like and subscribe.